G'day guys, it's Angus from McKim's Real Estate in Grafton and today we're talking about a really topical um, matter at the moment and that is the issue of gazumping. Okay, gazumping occurs when the owner of a property accepts a price verbally from one buyer but ends up actually selling the property to another buyer, typically for more money. Now the important thing to know about gazumping is that it is in no way illegal in New South Wales. It's not at all illegal. In fact, what is illegal is it's illegal for an agent not to pass on a higher offer to an owner. Okay, so don't blame the owner. We're often just as stressed by gazumping as you. Fortunately, in New South Wales, the consumer laws are built to protect the buyer of a property. And what a lot of people don't understand is that when you exchange contracts to buy a house in New South Wales, you have five working days, which often turns out to effectively be a whole week, to uh, think about the purchase, do any due diligence, and if need be, to cool off or rescind your contract and basically pull out. Now, this is an excellent way to secure a property because whilst you can, after consideration, decide to pull out for literally any reason, whether you get a negative pestle building report, whether you get bad news from your finance, or whether you just decide that it's not the property for you, but, and this is important, the owner cannot in any legal way sell the property for a higher price to any other buyer after you've exchanged that contract. So it basically gives you the right to secure it, have a look into it and work out whether you want to proceed or not. If you do want to proceed, you know you've got it locked in. If you don't, you know you can simply rescind. Now, does it cost anything? Of course, there are penalty fees. Rescinding on a standard sort of home sale in Grafton will cost you probably seven or eight hundred dollars. But if you think about the investment of three or four or five hundred thousand dollars when you're buying property, that's small change. I'm Angus McKim and that's the market.